Hi everyone, hello and welcome to Happy Saturday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here, we are back together and I am always so grateful, thankful and blessed to be here with every single one of you. I hope you all have had the most amazing couple of days since I saw you last on Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. We are back for another one and I have some magical, special and sparkly things to share before you beautiful faces. So I do want to jump into it because you know I'm excited about it as I normally am. Now I found a whole entire display case and the only thing that I am sad about is that I didn't find it just a little bit sooner because it was originally stocked full and I found it when it was almost bare. So this right here is um, was something that cost about $3.25 outside of the Dollar Tree. This is Hershey's Kisses and this is the Cherry Cordial. I do believe that that is how you say it. If I'm wrong, it's not the first time that I've been wrong about pronouncing something. And this is with jojoba oil and shea butter and it's flavored lip balm in this most adorable, special, awesome, Christmassy packaging so I am stoked about it this is so awesome for 125 and especially for stocking stuffer ideas then we have this wonderful one right here that was also around that same price range from outside of the Dollar Tree this is elf on a shelf my son had one did your kids have an elf on a shelf because that was a super fun part of his childhood this is marshmallow flavored lip balm and it comes in this most adorable little cup right here like a hot cocoa with some cream on top and the straw I love it it is so super duper cool and cute and I am so excited to have purchased that as well then I found this one last but not least and then they were pretty much out of them at this point this is taste of beauty this one was 225 outside of the dollar tree and it said shake it up and this is cranberry bellini flavored lip balm how nifty cool cute and awesome and i was so stoked and excited about it and you could put those in anybody's little stocking and i think that they would be super happy about it so there is that then Christmas Eve pajamas at the Dollar Tree for the little kiddos. I was stunned. So I found this most adorable little PJ top. Now all of these things were just basically thrown inside of a paperboard um, paperboard cardboard box and so I had to sift through the whole thing and the shirt and pajama bottoms were sold separately but this one is a 4T and I absolutely love the design on it. So picked up this 4T size. Then I was able to scout out the 4T pajama bottoms inside the box. But they did have so many great ones that were just too, too adorable. I picked out my most favorite sets for a little boy or a little girl on both of the ones that I'm about to show you. And it has the elastic waistband. So there is that cute, adorable PJ set. And then this for a little nightgown. How special. And this material here is very silky. And this is something my mom would have probably put me in. It is just so adorable with the beautiful little ki uh, kitties. And the um, it's kind of got a, like a flare style. So it tapers like at the top and then it comes out into a little bit of like a swooshy ending so that it will puff out at the bottom. And I thought that this was really, really so beautiful. The colors in it, everything. This is so special. And this one is a 2T. Now this one is PJ and me for the brand. And um, let me just get back that top really quick so I can tell you the brand of the other one. It's PJ and me too. So these cute little doodads for pajamas. Now, Santa always brought my son's pajamas for Christmas Eve and set them under the tree on Christmas Eve so that he could wear them as his first gift of Christmas. So that's what Santa did when he came over at my place. So there is that. Now we have so many things. I am just pumped, pumped about it. Now for my beautiful bedazzlers, my beautiful, beautiful people that love to do the gem art. I was so happy when I found a whole entire display of all of these wonderful sets from Crafter Square. Now this is diamond 
painting sheet and I was so excited because so many of you have bedazzled me the most beautiful pictures and absolutely stunning things that I display in my house that you've sent to me so I picked up the one that has these beautiful flowers in this nice little watering can and inside of this it comes with all of the little packages of gems and beading and this makes a six by eight inch picture so this over here is what you're going to get inside of the package it comes with that tool i'm not sure what this is it doesn't oh, okay contains diamond painting sheet sorting tray rhinestones silicone clay diamond painting pen instruction sheet so that is what is all right here that you are seeing to make this beautiful beautiful photograph so that is such a blessing and they had a couple of other ones i did take a picture of it and i will share it to my community tab so that i can show you what the other ones were that i stumbled upon so i love that and i'm so excited for you guys to get it for 125 if you find it that do the diamond art then i found more stamp sets that i don't have yet now this is 21 pieces of the crafters square little stamps and i love them now if you watched happy wednesday dollar tree haul i showed you a bunch of new stamping stuff that crafters square has come out with and then they have new uh sets so hello especially for you thinking of you love and hugs welcome a note to say little one family this says so many beautiful things that you can stamp out and you know doll up whatever you want to send away or just you know border some paper make something special for a letterhead to send to somebody so many things you can do with stamps this one is 21 pieces as well this one says happy time to celebrate happy birthday happiest i love happiest um hooray wishing you a bright future in your life so many wonderful wonderful sentiments on this stamp set also and then this one is last but not least for the stamps this is 21 pieces this says thank you um i'm touched beyond words i thought that that was beautiful thankful it says for your support and thank you for all you do there's a lot more than what I'm reading in each one of these sets I'm just pointing out a few so I'm so happy to see those and on happy Wednesday Dollar Tree haul I hauled a bunch more things for you guys to take a peek at because they're just so lovely now I do want to show you these most beautiful fabulous wonderful signs that come in these gorgeous little wooden boxes look at these you can display them either way honestly now this just says decor on it and this one says life takes us and they put the sticker right over it so let's see if I can get this packaging off really quickly without biting into it like I need to do most of the time with my little teethies um so let me get this off I'm almost into it I'm gonna take the packaging off so that I can show it to you fully this says life takes us to unexpected places places love brings us home so that is so beautiful and special and then it comes in this beautiful little case that you can display on this side if you would like with that beautiful scenery in it and if you can see it has like the gold foil look to it and on the lettering on that side so i'm absolutely in love with these and i think that they are magnificent this one i'm not going to take off because i can pretty much tell what it's going to say this says bless our home love and laughter on it it might say another word underneath the sticker but that's pretty much what it says and this one has silver flex throughout the lettering and then you turn it around and it has that gorgeous scene on the back of the little wooden box so i love it either way it's interchangeable and i think that they are so nice for displaying on a bookshelf a case or wherever you would like to somebody's desk at work or what have you i think it's just so lovely so i was very happy about that as well now okie dokie then let's get back to just a moment of this okay because there is a lot of christmas coming out and i'm really refraining from picking things up except for the things i really truly want right now before they disappear and i love this tree i know we've seen it probably last year come out but this one was just so full of snow that i needed it 
and it was fluffy and just beautiful so I picked it up comes on this little wooden stand right there so it'll be able to stand up on its own and it's a really great size and if I find small ornaments I'm gonna decorate my little tree and then this one I thought was really a lot of fun this could even be for like a beach type of you know decoration in the summertime I think this tree is really really cute and I can almost picture it in like a Hawaiian type of theme of decoration in your house for the warmer months so I scooped it up because I thought it was so interesting and unique and it comes on the little wooden stand right there so lovely and I loved the bright green coloring to it now okay so I found some fuzzy socks and these are so fun and gorgeous for this year and they are different from any of the ones I've found in the past so this is the Snugadoo brand and this is one size and these are so warm and cozy and it has this really really cute sweet adorable little doggy on it with bright red glasses and I just like the warm tones to this. It's very cuddly and cozy looking and I can't wait to wear them and I love 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 the Snugadoo brand so I picked that up. Then in other sock styles Snugadoo one size and these I've told you in the past in other years, this pilly feeling to these socks, I find very fascinating on my feet for some reason. I like the texture to them because you can even feel on the inside the texture and they're just fun to walk in. They're very like almost massaging to me in a way. So I like the colors of this, that like greeny, just like natural, beautiful, you know, outstanding outdoors like woodsy style of green with the little white mixture to it so I picked up that one and that is a color combination I haven't seen in that style sock ever come out so I was happy to grab that now let me look down down and all around when I'm wearing my fuzzy socks I want to be able to drink out of the cutest cup I've ever seen them come out with in the party section. Now this is Barbie and it has all of these stunning fabulous little gems on it. They're cute styling outfits and yes I am still celebrating my Barbie era in my mind and in my heart. Since that Barbie movie came out I have bedazzled as much as I could pink because it's made me extra happy so I did pick this up for 125 and that's my special cup <laughs> so I'm gonna have my sweet tea in it on a Saturday <laughs> so there is that now okay I am going to rock these new headbands I think that the style of them is absolutely beautiful so pretty cool and cute and I love the um the kind of just like twisty look that they did to these they also had it in a black and a gray I almost was tempted to pick up the other two but I really really especially loved this great purple color and so I definitely wanted to scoop this one up before it was gone and maybe I'll grab the black one if I really feel the need to and this is a very silky texture but I think that they're nice um they they're dressy looking so those could be sweet for the holidays and then this beautiful mauve pink one is just my favorite it really is my favorite that's just such a beautiful look and I have so many pretty clothes you know even tie-dye with pink in it that looks like this that that this headband can match and pair with really nicely so I scooped that up that's for sure and it made me really happy to do so now I gotta feel around gotta feel down around and out of town because I have stuff jam-packed everywhere I found all of these nice slippers and if you want to gift a cute little cozy set away to help somebody relax for the holidays we have some nice options here with different styles to them so this is from the juncture brand and this is a size five to nine and it fits most shoe sizes it says these are very stretchy and um I think that they would fit really really well to almost anybody with a size you know from 10 maybe even an 11 because I find a little bit of wiggle room in these even for myself now this whole entire plaid look to it would be perfect 
for you know thanksgiving through christmas time so i picked this one up and these are warm and fuzzy and you know i love the grippies because i've told you with the other sets that i've found and then we have these which is a super duper cute look to this style i love that color combination and that cheetah print look is so fun and now all of the sizes on each and every every one of these are the same that i've already stated in the last one so there's that then I found some Halloween ones. Look at the little ghosty with the mosty. These are just so cool and cute. So you can see the ghost the most and that little jack-o'-lantern right there. But I absolutely love the bright orange color. I think it's just so pretty cool and cute. And if we stay inside, you know, and just answer the door, these would be really cute to have on my feet with a Halloween costume on. So I picked that up and it made me extra excited too. And then this one. This one is so nice. I love that design, that style. I would actually like to find a flannel that could even potentially look close to those colors in a combination because I think that the print of this is just really, really pretty. So this is gorgeous, cool, cute, and every single one of them have the grippies on them as well. So scooped them up. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Now we're going to just keep picking and pulling because I have things all around me, all around me. You just have no idea. We have so much to go through. Okay. Now this I picked up, even though I don't know how to do them myself, but I sure do know somebody wonderful in my life that does know how to create these things. And I am going to send them to her and pay her to make them if she allows me to. So I found these whole sets from the Crafters Square brand and this is a DIY crochet set and this one makes this adorable little bunny. I could not even believe that they are selling these for $125. So inside of the packaging it comes with all of the instructions and the contents to be able to make it. It includes a plastic needle, yarn, stuffing, a crochet hook, plastic beads, instruction sheet. So this one is the the sweet beautiful adorable little bunny can you honestly believe it then this one right here is the beautiful gorgeous little bear so awesome and imagine if somebody you know in your life or you yourself knows how to crochet to be able to pick these up for 125 have yourself a beautiful relaxing crochet uh, crocheting session and then be able to put these in a child's gift that would be so, so fabulous. And so here is this one with the sweet, beautiful, extra cute little doggy right there. I picked up every single one. There's not one I could leave behind. Then that sweet little mouse. I love it with that beautiful, mauve cute pink sweater on. So I picked up that guy right there. And then we have the unicorn. Is the unicorn not gorgeous absolutely gorgeous so the person that is gonna possibly crochet these for me she crocheted me a big unicorn that I shared on a community tab when I got the friend mail in and this is his baby this is the baby of the beautiful big unicorn that she made me so he matches they have their beautiful um manes that are colorful and this is going to be the babe so i love that that just made my heart happy then this one right here is an awesome cool dinosaur so i couldn't believe it this is just so outstanding to me i my nana's all could crochet my mom can knit i can't do either <laughs> <laughs> so I'm so happy to know people that do still have that skill and that fun, you know, artistic way that they can do it still. So that's awesome. Now, alrighty then. I did find another cool little set and this one is for Christmas. Um, this is a pom-pom craft kit. This is 50 pieces. The only thing about the Christmas ones that I've found, which I had to pick up the reindeer because I love the reindeer with the little Santa hat on and the big red nose for Rudolph. Um, but in the 
Halloween and Thanksgiving ones, they had big paper plates that you could do crafts on. And then Christmas showed up and they're doing it on mini paper plates. So that's kind of different. I just wonder, just out of curiosity, why they scaled back on the size of the paper plate. But it's still a fun, awesome craft. And I'm so happy to have found that for sure. Now, okie dokie then, we have some more things. This right here, I cannot wait to give it a try. This is an LED shadow projector. And right here, if you can see, it has ghosts, jack-o'-lantern, a witch, bats, and everything else flying around. And so this takes three AAA batteries. Let me make sure I am saying that right because I did read it earlier. Um, I'm thinking it does. That is what I remember reading. It has an on and off switch and three AAA batteries will go inside of this. And then I hope that it projects really nicely because that would be super duper cool, cute and spooky to cast upon like the ceiling or the wall. So this is a nice little thing. I did find this up by the register in just like a box. So that's awesome. Then I found these and these were so pretty. I thought that they would be beautiful, like on the Thanksgiving table illuminated. This is LED pillar candle. And if you can see, it has like a sunflower look to it. Let me take it off and see if we can see underneath this. Um, they got these things taped like nobody's biz. They've got them taped like bananas. Hello. Wow, we're not getting into anything today. <laughs> there it is. So here's the white one. And you can see it has the little um, the little flame inside, the little fake flame. And then on the bottom it has a switch, but it also has a pull tab. So just make sure when you pick these up, if you do, to make sure that the pull tab is still in it so that you can tell if it has been messed with or not. So I just pulled my pull tab out and it has a beautiful flickering light. So there is the white one. Let me shut that off before I wear it out. Then I also picked up the beautiful yellow one. So, so beautiful. I like the three colors together too. I think that they look stunning. And then this one right here, which has the orange and all three have the pull tabs. And now this does say it goes up to 120 hours and this is the luminescent brand for all three of them. And I think that they look so folly cool and cute together. So I was happy to grab those as well. Then I found a beautiful, gorgeous rug to match all of my leaf decorations that I've been picking up from the Dollar Tree. And this nice one right here just says welcome on it. I usually put this in my entryway just so people can like leave their shoes and they can step on something warm while they're putting socks on. On the back, it does have a scruffy texture to the back, but if you want, you can just get one of those little um, non-slip mats that are also at the Dollar Tree, usually over by like the hand towels and the towels and things like that. Um, it will have like a no slip mat that you can set under it. So I did pick that up and I'm happy to have that for my hallway. So I grabbed it. Yes, I certainly did. Now, okay, are we ready? I found great coloring books and a paint a water paint one so i love these because i love gifting away crafts artistic things books and clothing for everybody so picking up this was a lot of fun because it was a new and different coloring and activity book now this is pete the cat and um it says it's all good and he is a cool cat on a skateboard so i grabbed it and now if you guys can remember from quite a while ago i did find uh, Pete the cat stickers as well. So if you still have those on hand, you could find a coloring book to match and put it as a cute little set with some crayons. So gray pages in here to roam through, color and do some activities. So I scooped that up. Then puppies, puppies and kitties paint with water. I always loved the paint with water when I was growing up when my mom would get them for me because I thought it was like magic when the color would come onto the pages. So really, really awesome pictures inside of it. And even if you paint with water, that's just fun and crafty as well to sit there and kind of just take a moment to relax and watch the picture come to life. So I thought that that was really beautiful. 
And now for the last few things, we have some patches. We have some beautiful patches and I actually got a friend mail card today from a beautiful friend named Debbie and she sent me a patch set that I didn't see when I was at the Dollar Tree. So I was so happy to get one that I didn't even know about. Now this is mermaid theme and this is iron on patches. So I picked up those little cutie pies right in there and you know mermaids are my loves so I picked those and then I picked this set now there were probably two others just not the one that actually was sent to me I can't even believe there's even more out there but these were my two favorite that I actually purchased and found myself I love the galaxies and I love the little rocket ship and the astronaut right there so four more patches in that set then, then I found these wonderful iron on transfers and there was about six, I think. Um, the other one that I left behind was feathers and I can't remember what the second one was, but these four I had to have. We have these special kitties right there and I'm thinking about doing like a Christmas gift for all my neighbors that are cat lovers and doing something with the iron on transfer. I might, you know, just make them a cute little placemat and put little kitties on them or whatnot. I don't know. I'll come up with something and gift it away. So I picked up this set right there. Then we have these beautiful, colorful, awesome cactuses that I think are really groovy, cool, and cute. I love like almost the quilted look to the um, design of each one of them. They're just so interesting, cool, artistic, and unique. And then we have these awesome pineapples. Look at how fun and fabulous those are. So I think that those are pretty spiffy. And now they do have all kinds of um, little bags and stuff like burlap bags and canvas bags you could make yourself an adorable little tote bag with some of these images on it and then here are the llamas so these are so special and I love how colorful bright happy and vibrant every single thing is that I found in the crafter square section so that is that now last but not least these are the last two things let me feel around make sure I am correct in what I'm saying um, um, and then I got to show you guys something that I made. Then right here, I picked up these two sticker sheets because they were just whimsical and beautiful. And I've been having a lot of fun making mini scrapbooks out of the scrapbooking paper that I found in packages over this last week. And I wanted some new sticker embellishments. So this is the pop-up stickers and there's 12 pieces in here. And I think that the color and just like the cool flary look to the leaves is really, really beautiful. So I grabbed that set. And then this is pop up too, and this is a 12 count. And these have the, uh, you know, the kind of really, uh, not metallic, but you know, just the glittery border around each one of the feathers. And I love how bright, colorful, and awesome they are. So there is that. Now that is it. That is it. My little honey doodads. That is it. Happy, happy Saturday Dollar Tree haul. I love you guys so incredibly much. Thank you so much for being here with me. And for those of you that are new here, hi, I'm Callan. I would love it if you'd stick around, stay, like, share, subscribe, comment down below, hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that I upload a new video. Here on this channel, I do Dollar Tree hauls on Saturdays, Mondays, and Wednesdays, and I'm absolutely in love with being here with my beautiful wonderful fantastic village that we have all built together so thank you for that um and now for the last couple of minutes i told you guys in a community tab post that i was going to share with you the many scrapbooks that i'm making with the scrapbooking paper and my pictures so this case actually came from the dollar tree probably well over a year ago and i'm using it as like a little storage bag for my mini scrapbooks that I'm making. So I'm not gonna show you the whole thing. I'm just gonna show you a few at a time. Everything that went into this was from the Dollar Tree, the stickers, the little gems. Only thing is my photographs. So this is the front cover of my little scrapbook. And then I'll show you two pictures so right here this is us on our way to pennsylvania over the springtime so that is my husband and i in the car and then on the back i embellished it just like this with some of the stickers i had on hand 
And then we also have this picture of myself as we got into the hotel room and we were just chilling and relaxing, cozy on the bed. And that is the back of it that I did. I'll show you one more. Um, we'll do three at the end of every haul until they're done. There's 12 pictures in each mini scrapbook. And then there is my husband and I for a little selfie shot, our loving moment of just spending time with each other. And then on the back, it says best friends. They know how crazy you are and they still, still choose to be seen with you in public. <laughs> and that is one of my favorite stickers that I have ever found in one of the sticker sheets at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> so there is that. I love it. And I love you guys. And thank you for staying with me those few moments extra. I love you. I hope you have a beautiful, wonderful, fantastic, happy weekend. And I will be seeing you and talking to you on happy monday dollar tree hall bye everyone